Hello and welcome. This is Terrahawk playing Entwined on PS3. This is one of June's free games on PSN for PSN Live subscribers. Um, yeah, so let's get to it. Let's get on playing. So, quick look in options. Gonna leave hints on. Keep the language English. Volume settings. You can change music and sound. Alter slightly. Control settings. Got sensitivity, vibration, and your dragon control Y axis inverted. Some point then we should be a dragon. It's always exciting. Um, let's go into the story. Lifetimes, all these different lifetimes. Let's do our first lifetime. Um, this was a new game to me. Hadn't heard of this one before. Entwined is basically a twin stick endless runner. Um, very similar to the idea of Res. The goldfish to the left can only stay on the left hand side, controlled by the left stick. The bird is on the right hand side, can only stay on the right hand side. And you're basically aiming to get them to go swim fly through their respective colours. You see, as we pick up these little things, their lifelines at the top bump up ever so slightly. And when we see a green thing ahead, they have to come very close together. Uh, they cannot go onto the opposite sides of their screen. And what we're aiming to do then is trying to get their, I call them life bars, I guess, uh, to meet in the middle. And this lifetime, when it says lifetime, I believe that works the same way as resin. That's just the levels that you're on to. Uh, there's a very kind of ambient, electronic ambient soundtrack in the background. Oops, missed all of those. Missed all of those. And it's just going as a kind of nice little dreamy. Uh, Scaffold along those ways. I mean, this is kind of their all that's to it. There's a little bit more thought involved, and in you've got, whoops, you've got the, you're looking after two creatures at once rather than the one, but certainly in this earlier le level, there's nothing, no obstacles to go through. Ooh, hello. Oops, and as you can see, there's a hit there. We see red. Red is bad. Oops. And you, as they make the things slightly more challenging, the things they will start. To, sorry, I'm not concentrating then. Oops. Concentrate on one, and you stop concentrating on the other. You sometimes get multiples of these circles out. Oops. I mean, there's not much more you can. Oops, you can save for these sorts of ones. Um. These aren't quite the same layouts as I've obviously tried this game out once already to see actually trying to fix issues with my controller system um, I don't believe these are the same layouts as I had before so the backgrounds are the same I'm sure that later on levels there will be less time between the discs and more than these two in the fruit And I've been able to link them together. Now I still need to carry on playing. Even though I've linked up my bars to go, I need to actually need to get into touch. So nearly there. Transform. And there's your dragon. Uh, yeah, at this point, 
the aim now is in this little landscape is to pick up all the various different coloured crystals. Uh, it is entirely possible at this point I'm using both sticks to control. I could just use one and I can use two to make the turns a little bit faster. And now once I've got that, I do these colored trails and kind of any which way I want to do them. Ooh. And if you bounce into something, you just kind of bounce off it. You can bounce into the floor. You head up to the roof. And then wherever you finish it, the path opens for the next level. Uh, that is pretty much entwined. Um, yeah, it's, it's an endless flyer. So, yeah, I've been Terrahawk. Uh, thank you all for watching, and we will see you on the next one. Bye for now.